Hi everybody! I thought I would go over the best themed Walt Disney World restaurants in my opinion in no particular order. I would recommend the primetime 50s if you like kind of a shtick of the 50s where don't put your elbows on the table, don't chew gum. And when I went there for the first time they assigned us homework and one of my friends was caught cheating and using his cell phone so she took away our list and we had to start over and I didn't finish my greens and I tried to hide it with a napkin when I was done and she brought me back my greens with whipped cream and made me eat a piece. So if you don't like that kind of antics, I wouldn't suggest this kind of place for you. But the food is really good. I highly recommend the meatloaf or the fried chicken. I personally always get the fried chicken and this place is famous for the peanut butter and jelly shake. I would also recommend that. And my husband actually got a really amazing fish special here. They do have really good fish specials at the prime time. Just FYI, you wouldn't think that, but they do. And the next place is the Sci-Fi Drive-In. Oh, I forgot to say, that's at the Disney Hollywood Studios. The next one I'm about to talk to is the Sci-Fi Drive-In. And when you walk inside, it's so cool. The ceiling's really high. It's like you're outside in the dark watching old snippets from old sci-fi cartoons and movies and that kind of thing. They have really good burgers and shakes here so I would highly recommend those if you have picky eaters. They are expensive burgers but they're really good in my opinion. And one of our favorite restaurants to go in Epcot is over at the Beer Garden. Just beware that you do sit, they have these huge picnic benches and you do sit with other people, especially if you're a party of two. I've never had a problem with sitting people who are rude or anything like that. Everybody's, it's a really fun atmosphere. They have a Germany band playing. There's people dancing up front. It's a really fun atmosphere and this is a buffet. They have everything from authentic German food to stuff for really, really picky eaters. Like I'm pretty picky, but my husband wanted to go here. I really enjoy the Schafferhofer Hefefeisen beer here and they have really good salmon here which I was really surprised by so definitely check that out and my husband had all of the they have like black forest cake some apple dessert everything was really good and if you have a little boy in your party I would recommend going to the Disney Springs they have a T-Rex restaurant it can be kind of loud depending on the age of your kids it can be scary they have like huge t-rexes they have a really cool ice cave kind of a room that you can sit in and it's like really pretty blue and purple and it lights up now and then it's pretty cool and the bar there is actually really good too they bring you a beer and a frozen goblet which i was really surprised by how Big the cup was and it was frozen and it tasted really nice and frosty and the food there was actually really good <laughs> I was really surprised at how good the food was I wasn't expecting much for the t-rex and my friend randomly and we were just a two adult party and we had a lot of fun when we went and the last restaurant I want to talk about is the whispering canyon you can find this restaurant over at the wilderness lodge they do have coasters if you don't want to participate in the antics. You put stop for your coaster or go if you want to play along with the fun. Like one of the thing is, things are if you drink your whatever drink you order, if you drink it too fast, they will bring back a literal like huge mug like that big with whatever you're drinking. And if you ask for ketchup, they will bring every single bottle of ketchup to your table. Um, and they have lots of other activities for the kids to do. And it's a really fun environment. When me and my husband went for our first time together to Disney, it was our anniversary. And they gave us two free glasses of champagne with strawberries. But they made us kiss in front of the whole restaurant until they counted to 10 very slowly. And it's a memory I will never forget. And so that's why we love Whispering Canyon. And they do have a breakfast that gets pretty good reviews. And for the dinner, they have this huge skillet. It's all you care to eat. I think it's around 30 bucks per person for adults. And it comes with mashed potatoes, corn, ribs, chicken, all this great stuff. And I would highly recommend going there if that's the kind of food you like. 
and these are my top five restaurants. Please let me know your opinions on these places or what your favorite themed restaurants are at Disney World. Please remember to give this video a like and if you have any questions at all, I will be more than happy to answer your questions. Either email me or put a comment down below. Thanks and remember to subscribe. Bye!